Hi, my name is Will Carpenter, and I'd like to welcome you to American Cool Television. Today's word's definition. The annual festival commemorating the birth of Jesus. One synonym is christening, etymology, anointed, and Messiah. Do you know what word we have up here? Well, as far as I'm concerned, Christmas is every day, so it doesn't matter when I put this word up. It works. To pull this word apart, we got a mass of Christ, and Christ is a type and a quality of light that was made famous by Jesus. But Jesus didn't invent this light, and it predates Jesus. I could throw the word Shekinah up here, and that has nine letters, and it's the same exact light. Just different religions have different ways to express themselves. And a mass of Christ is a body of coherent matter. And you have matter, the M-A right here, the call letters. And when you're talking about coherency, we have S for sticking together. And when we pull Christ apart, we can see I-S-T. It's an ist. And if we put the word artist up here, we can see art I state or I state art. So Christ is really talking about stating the R-C-H, and C-H is really for X. And when we're talking about a regulated X, we are talking about the vital principles here within a human being, and it's known as a three-in-one X. We have the mental state, the emotional state, and the physical state. And let me tell you, folks, we're turned on in every moment, every instant, we're in a mental state, an emotional state, and a physical state. And that Christ light is talking about regulating these states, and that's basically cleaning them up. We have a lot of just extraneous thoughts. We have a lot of baggage in our emotional realm. And take a look at our physical bodies. They probably all could use some work. And that's what this Christ spirit is representing, is working on yourself and making your light much more refined and much more radiant. So, we have a mass, and that mass, another way to express that mass is to say it's a cloud. Christ can become a cloud, and also it can become a mist. And that is Chris Mist.